Hi there, everyone. I'm meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. As we continue through the second half of the day, we are going to keep the clouds around and there will be a chance for some isolated showers and storms. But with the clouds, that'll keep the atmosphere more stable. So it's not going to lead to the likelihood of any strong or severe thunderstorms like we had last night. Uh, as we go through the overnight hours, expect mostly cloudy skies. And even on Friday, the clouds will kind of drag their heels. And once again, especially going into the second half of the day, there will be a chance for some isolated showers and storms. Once again, not a great chance of seeing any strong or severe thunderstorms, although I'd say right around the 95 corridor and points west, that's where you do have a better chance of seeing some strong storms. And here you go. There's some more storms expected for a 9 to 10 o'clock Friday night, but then we drive for Saturday morning. But unfortunately, the weekend is not going to stay perfectly dry. So for tonight, showers early, otherwise mostly cloudy with lows around 71. And then tomorrow, mainly cloudy with a few showers, especially through the second half of the day with highs around 85 degrees. Here's a look at our seven day forecast. So will be a chance for a few showers going into Saturday afternoon. And then once again, we could see some isolated showers on Father's Day. Now, you certainly don't have to cancel your outdoor plans this weekend. But as we always say, you certainly want to keep an eye on the radar, whether you're going to be at Pride Fest or doing any outdoor activities for Father's Day. Again, just keep an eye on the radar. Unfortunately, the unsettled pattern continues right into the first half of next week.